This is the first dog we're going to show you today. And her name is Sissy. She is a three-month-old Beagle Mix puppy. Very, very sweet. Very playful. She does like to cuddle. And as you can tell watching her pull, she wants to be with people. She's great with anybody, kids, dogs, cats, as long as they play with her. And she can be a little overwhelming because she is a puppy. Now, she needs to go to a home where somebody will be home to housebreak her, to train her. I think you need to pick her up and cuddle her. I think that's what she really wants. Yeah. She's a little bit insecure on this slippery floor. She's a little bit insecure being out of the cage and away from her sister. But she is a ball of energy. She's cute as she can be. She's very loving. And if you've got the time and the patience, you could have yourself a great puppy. Her name is Sissy, and there she goes. The dog you're looking at now is Flag. Flag is a beagle mix. Uh, again, a very energetic beagle mix. He's a neutered male. He's five years old. And it says here, I pull a bit on the leash, and I can tell you that they're absolutely correct saying that. I love to sniff around typical beagle behavior. I know set, but I don't want to. I really want to choke myself trying to get over there and lick those people in the face. And I love going on long walks. This is an active, energetic young dog. He's very beautiful, and you can tell he's checking out the floor completely. Hey, you, we want the front end. He has a beautiful face and very loving eyes. Flag. Flag. And as you can see, he's, he's absolutely adorable. This dog only wants somebody to love. If you look at the love in that dog's eyes, he's just dying to share them with someone. So if you're looking for a medium-sized, very, very dear, very kind dog who will keep you running a little bit, take a look at Flag. The dog you're looking at now is Brina. Brina is a seven-year-old spayed female hound mix. And I love what's written on my, on my cheat sheet notes. It says, I am an attention hog. I do well with most dogs. She normally walks well on a leash, but of course she's excited about being out of her cage right now. And there's some noises, and it says specifically, she's frightened of loud noises. So when, they, when she hears an unexpected noise, she's going to startle. She plays with plush toys. She plays with rope toys. She's a little bit nervous, and I think the camera has her a little bit frightened. But she is a very dear, very sweet, very loving dog. So if you're looking for a little more laid back, if you're looking for a dog who will absolutely glory to be with you and curl up by your feet or in your lap if you let her, Brynna is, she's volunteering for the position. She really wants to get out of here. She wants to get into a home. She wants to be someone's special pet. And she wants someone to whom she can give all the love that's sitting in her heart right now and just waiting for a person. Her name is Brynna. She is very, very dear. Soft, gentle, loving, and absolutely wonderful. Take a look at Brynna's face. You can see the love in her eyes. The dog you're looking at now is Neil. Neil is a neutered male three-year-old rat terrier. Um, a little bit shy of strangers. He has to get to know you. Once he gets to know you, he is a cuddle bug. Likes having his butt scratched. That's his favorite thing. He likes cuddling, and he likes being on the couch with you or on your lap. Both of those satisfy his need for loving. He does no sit. We don't think he knows he's, he's not had any other training. Obviously, he's little. He's not big enough to haul you around. Um, very, very sweet little guy and very beautiful. Hey, Neil. Now, he doesn't even want to look at us because we have a camera, and the camera has a light, and the camera and the light are very scary, and he's being remarkably brave right now. So as with many of these little ones, he has to get to know you. You need a little patience. You need a lot of kindness, and sometimes a treat or two helps, too. But he's only looking for a forever home and somebody he can love. His name is Neil. This beautiful girl you're looking at now is Hannah. She's a lab hound mix. She's about seven years old. Great with other dogs. However, she will compete for food or sometimes for toys, so she should be separated when she has a toy or when she's eating. Again, very friendly, but very shy in new places and new things and new people. 
She's looking for a calm, quiet home, somebody who will take the time to reassure her and help her not be as fearful because she she really wants to be a pet. She really wants to be loving. Right now, she really wants to leave because we're scaring her. But if you can see that beautiful face, if you have a little time to invest in just reassuring her and making sure she knows that you're there to love her, not hurt her, and that you don't want to scare her, she will return every little piece of love that you give her a hundredfold because she really needs to feel safe and secure and she really wants to love and be loved. She's a sweet, loving dog and her name is Hannah. This is Briggs. Briggs is Sissy's brother. They came in together. So again, three months old, Beagle Mix. Loves to play, loves people, loves kids, loves dogs, loves cats, loves anybody who will pet him, loves to sniff, loves to explore, like loves to stick those beagly ears down on the ground and the nose on the ground, <laughs> loves to jump up and give wild kisses. And yes, he will be a handful. For months and months, he will be a handful. He will teeth, he will chew, he will pee in the house and poop in the house. And he will do all kinds of naughty things until he learns to be a responsible canine citizen. But the one thing he will be throughout it all is a lot of fun and a huge challenge. So if you're up for the challenge and you're not afraid that maybe, God forbid, he might pee on a carpet, because he will, and you're going to be around enough to train him and socialize him, but mostly to love him, Briggs would just love to go home with you. <laughs> the noisy girl you're looking at now is Wendy. Wendy is a spayed female beagle. She is 13 years old. And if you look at her Paul and Ron, you wouldn't believe it for a minute. She's full of energy. She's Oh, her biggest thing is sniffing after leftover treats. Yes, indeed. Um, yes, sweet girl. She's very much a talker. Very much a talker. And she needs someone who's home a lot because she needs to go out a lot. She's housebroken, but she just doesn't have the control she had when she was younger. So somebody who will take her home despite her age and say, okay, she's old and she's got, she could have six years, she could have two years, she could have five years, we just don't know. But whatever time she has, what she needs is somebody to love her. She would be perfect as a senior pet. She'd be perfect for anybody who doesn't mind beagle baying because she's very much a talker. You're looking at Wendy. <laughs> this is the last dog we're going to show you today. We're showing you Tracker. Tracker is a neutered male. He's a two-year-old German Shepherd mix. Um, likes tennis balls. He'll run after them, but he sure as heck won't bring them back. Loves attention. Has nothing by way of training. Um, he's going to need the basics. He's going to need housebreaking. He's going to need all of it. He's been kept outside, and as a result, he is heartworm positive, which is why he is our special needs dog. For as long as he's in treatment for heartworm, and Save a Pet will underwrite the cost of that treatment and perform that treatment for you. Uh, but as long as he's, uh, he's heartworm positive, he can't run and he can't get excited because there are heartworms in his heart, and if they break loose, they can kill him. So he has to be kept relatively quiet. He has to be leash walked. He has to be cuddled and loved. No problem doing that, folks. Uh, until such time as his blood work comes back, testing that he no longer is heartworm positive. At that point, he can do anything and will because he is a very, very loving dog. So Tracker is our special needs dog for the day. Let's see if we can get his face up here so you can see. Tracker loves people. Tracker is absolutely gorgeous, and he's looking for a forever home.